What up, what up, what up? What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Your boy Jazz, welcome back to another Madden 25 team play. We have the Seattle Seahawks going up against the Carolina Panthers. Definitely a matchup of two very tough defenses. Now, we already know, you know, why I would want the Seahawks because they got Sherman, the Sherman Nator. Let's go on ahead and lock up that right side. We all know Ziploc back GS, GS Island is in full effect. And actually, this right here turns out to be one very, very interesting game. So, we begin defensively and uh, shout out to the people that we went against. You know, our opponents, I feel like um, they played team play. How it was meant to be played? You know, they didn't really run the ball a lot. You know, just a lot of passing, trying to give the ball to, you know, uh, the users on the other team. And, you know, of course, you got your occasional running. But, like, we played against people who, you know, I've played team play against people in the streams. And they would just, they would play fag D. They'd run, you know, options and all this other stuff. And I'm just like, why? Why would you do that stuff, man? That stuff is not fun. To me, team play is very, very fun. But, you know, one of the fun aspects is, you know, throwing the ball to... You know uh, the other controlled players. So yeah, like I'll have a computer that could be open, but no, I'm trying to force feed as we throw interception right there. I'm trying to force feed my other teammates, man. You know that's the fun part. You know you running a, a, a route that people run some crazy routes too, yo. They be running like in the middle field. They'll just do like a Z and a nine, and I'm like, what is that? You know that's what makes it very difficult as well. The fact that there's no communication. You know I can't speak to them. They can't speak to me. I'm just hiking and you know hoping they will stay on you know a route you know on one path and you know get open so you know our opponents really you know they passed the ball a lot they were passed to the users and to me uh it made for a more fun game you know what i mean when you're actually able to uh you know just make it a, a passing fest and and you know not trying to play it like it's a money game right there he's some dirt son i'm trying i'm trying to make some moves in right there i don't know what's up with my reads man i'm, I'm trying to find these guys open again i'm not really looking for the computer I'm just throwing it to uh, the users and right there. Speaking of users, we throw right into a uh, interception right there. And uh, that right there is not a good start. You know, we have an opportunity. Well, I should say they have an opportunity to go up, you know, 17-0 uh, or 13-0. And, of course, we don't want that, right? We don't want that deficit. So, 3rd and 29 came to him backs up. Yeah, we actually get a sack. And we actually forced... A punt which is big now we do get ball at halftime so scoring right here you know would be big even if it's a field goal let's just put something on the board and i know it relies heavily on me you know i got to be able to find you know the open receiver so um they also the panthers they, they actually did a very good job of mixing up some blitzes as well so uh they definitely sent some pressure so right here we roll out man I'm trying to buy some time just just trying to <laughs> trying to make something happen right there man we just thought it at the very last second I'm trying my best, man, to, to find people and coverage, man. You guys got to get open. Y'all got to get open. Right there, go towards the sideline. And, again, that is one thing that is a little frustrating when you're playing team play and you have no communication is the fact that somebody will be, like, running over the middle, and he'll be open over the middle. I will throw it, and then they'll just, you know, cut immediately back towards the sideline. And I'm like, why would you do that? You was open. Why would you do that? You know what I mean? So, uh. Uh, I, I definitely need to put in my uh, what does the PS4 come with? It comes with one of those little earbud mics. Look like you work for T-Mobile. I need to get one of those. I just need to plug that bad boy in and maybe uh, be able to communicate with my guys and uh, be able to stay in one, uh, you know, one clear mind. So right here, man. Two minutes remaining. We go to the read option. Of course, I, I'm against read options in T-Play. I'm actually hoping that they played the uh, quarterback so I can hand it off. And uh, they did it, and I felt bad after even running that, so I didn't do that anymore. Right here, man, I'm just swerving. I'm swerving, trying to find. I'm like, somebody get open, man. Somebody get open. Come on, man. We can do it. I believe. I believe. Right there, man. Again, we did have triangle dragging open. But like I said, man, I want to be able to throw to the user as much as possible. Right here, man, just look at the computer. Stick it to him like glue, right? Look, I created an extra seven seconds of somebody being able to get open. Nobody gets open. And I'm like, you got to be kidding me. How did we get nobody open? Fourth and 40, I'm like, we got this. We're going to go for it. We're going to get it. I'm going to roll out. And we throw it up for Chucks. And end up decline. I mean, I'm knocking that down. And unfortunately for us, we don't get the first down. So, 10-0, a minute remaining, man. They are in perfect position to go on ahead. 
and you know be able to score at least a field goal possibly even a touchdown they have two timeouts with plenty of time from this distance man right there don't don't throw it to the right son it ain't it's just not gonna work gs silent is over there fourth and two they decided to go for it and cam newton throws an interception right there and right now it's like okay maybe we can just squeeze our way into field goal range like i said we do get ball at half so right here man we roll out i'm looking and i find the wide open receiver you know uh in that type of situation man i don't like throwing to the computer but we got to get a field goal range right there man we lose one of our um one of our users which is frustrating usually in team play man there's always a couple people that drops from the game that right there sucks. You definitely don't want that happening. Right there, we go deep up top. Here we end up finding my main man prospect who comes through with the catch. Two seconds remaining. We call our last time out. I wanted to go for the end zone. I was like, you know, let's play smart. We get ball at halftime, and let's play smart. So right now, we don't have a user. You know what I mean? So right now, it's just me and prospect since our other teammate uh, got disconnected. So right now, it's just me and him. And, of course, as always, man. I am trying to uh, pass right there. He messed that up. Prospect messed the computer was completely butt naked on that. I rerouted him towards the right. Look at look at me throwing these dots though. I rerouted him towards the left side, and as soon as I threw it, he took control of the computer and completely moved him out of the way. So right here, man, I'm just trying to find anybody that's open, man. Um, with with it only being one user, right there, he made a bunch of great moves right there. With it only being one user, man. Uh, Makes it a little easier to try and focus because when you got two guys that are controlling wide receivers, they, they just go crazy out there. Look at them hitting us with the old fashioned back cheese, uh, uh, back cheese, what am I, back juke cheese right there. He actually still scored a touchdown, like, because you know, once you hit the back juke, your stamina is depleted 100%, it's gone. So, here's with the back juke and still had enough speed to outrun everybody. I'm thinking to myself, you got to be kidding me right now, man. Right here, man, just trying to find somebody open. And that's what I'm talking about. He was running towards the left, and then he cut back inside towards the right. And, and that is the, the communication that uh, goes wrong sometimes. Right here, man, we just end up finding the uh, computer as Prospect takes over. It actually breaks a couple tackles. You see, they were really trying hard for that strip button. So, uh, right here, man, Russell Wilson drives back. Man, I'm trying to make something happen, man, but we don't get anything. Second and 18 is like, you know what? We got this, man. We only down seven. So let's see if we can go on ahead and tie this game up, man. Right, I'm trying for my life just to extend the play, man. See if we can get somebody open. And I was running for my damn life, and I couldn't get anybody. Right, we go deep up top towards the middle, and he drops the ball. That right there would have made it a manageable fourth down, which we would have went for. But since we dropped it, let's play it smart. Let's go on ahead and punt the ball with one minute remaining in the fourth quarter. It is not looking good for us whatsoever. We are about to be down. 20 to 10 at the least possibly 24 to 10 throws right into coverage right over our defender's head and we were unable to get an interception that right there was definitely frustrating so we are down two scores and uh we need to get the ball rolling right here so 20 seconds remaining we try to play action again man as soon as i hike the ball there's people in my face immediately but we still have uh a beautiful throw on the run right there so right now, it is the fourth quarter. So let's get the epic football music going. So here we go, Russell Wilson. He draws back. He's looking. He's got people. He's some dirt son. And right there, we pass backwards. Like, whoop, what is going on there? Second and ten right here. We go to the play action. And, and we are actually looking. We are just, just dodging and weaving. And we're trying to extend the play. Somebody get open. Please, please, somebody get open. We throw across field. And we are unsuccessful on that pass attempt. Third and ten right here. We just do a really quick out route and we end up successfully picking up the first down. So here's Russell Wilson again continuing the drive. Rolling out towards the right side. And we end up throwing another dot towards the right side. And that right there puts us in prime position going ahead and score a touchdown. Right here again, Russell Wilson is just using his legs trying to create some havoc. And nobody's open. What does he do with it? Whoop! He ends up running right into the end zone. Making it a one score lead so hopefully we can go on ahead and get ourselves a stop with an opportunity to go on ahead and tie this game so right here very important defensive possession right here it's came new and he drives back he goes deep over the middle and thankfully that right there is stripped out causing an incompletion second and ten we send a little bit of heat towards the left side causing an incompletion third and ten came new and throws right over the middle successfully completing that pass picking up the first down continuing to drive also bringing it down to the two minute warning and right now, it's looking like the Seahawks' chances of being able to come back in this game is uh, not too likely. He goes deep, and it's an interception. No, so you. Give it to me, baby. And the Seahawks still have life with a minute 35 left. They have to go downfield, drive 90 yards to be able to get in the end zone. 
inside this game. Russell Wilson across the field right there. Ends up throwing to Marshawn Lynch who almost uh, breaks the tackle right there. But he's tackled immediately. So right there again, we throw another pass right there. Picking up a good seven yards. Less than a minute remaining right here. Russell Wilson, he ends up looking like he's about to take off. But then he finds a receiver cutting cross towards the left side for the first down. Let's see if Russell Wilson can drive down this field and be able to score a touchdown. Right there, it's a sack right there. And right now, second and ten, we stand up in the pocket. Just a really quick wheel roll. The Marshawn and look at Marshawn go. The beast mode engage is on. Timeout with only 30 seconds remaining. He rolls to the left. He's looking. And he throws again. Cross field right there. And he got a couple blockers ahead of him. Almost gets the first down. Another timeout. Second two. They decide to run the ball. Marshawn Lynch gets into the end zone. Tying up the game. Ladies and gentlemen, we are headed in. To overtime, the Seattle Seahawks win the coin toss. They elect to receive, of course. And Russell Wilson with the hot hand is back on the field with the opportunity to win this game. Right there is a play action. Bootleg towards the right side and he ends up throwing a completion towards. Nope, I'm sorry. He couldn't get the Ronald McDonald feet in bounds. Second and 10, they go to another play action. Bootleg towards the left side. Russell Wilson almost got sacked right there. Very dangerous play. Decided to just throw it away right there. Third and ten, they need his first down. He rolls towards the right and just a quick wheel run to the backfield. And Turbin, he ends up picking up the first down, which was huge. Again, Russell Wilson, he's making some plays with his feet. Whoop! Whoop! He's some third son. It looks like he's got a receiver. He throws on the run in. I throw an interception. And they end up scoring on the ensuing possession. And we lose the game. I got confused because of, because of the jerseys. I thought that I had two receivers over there. I, that light blue jersey really just, I thought I had two receivers. I just didn't see it. I just didn't see it. We throw an interception. Oh, that's the end of the game, guys. Hope you guys enjoy. It's your boy Jess. I'm out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.